Well, a quiet resignation yesterday of the Prime Minister's Chief of Staff on the Sunday of a long weekend may have been an attempt to sweep away controversy, but it hasn't worked. Today, the RCMP are being asked to investigate whether any laws were broken when Nigel Wright, the Prime Minister's right-hand man, bailed out Senator Mike Duffy. The opposition also wants to know what Prime Minister Harper knew about the transaction and when he knew it. Our report tonight from Global National's Mike Armstrong. I traveled to my home. The Conservative government may be stinging from a string of resignations, but its members appear to be highlighting it instead as a positive, a sign of accountability. On Twitter, Calgary MP Joan Crockett this afternoon, quote, our government has the highest ethical standards demonstrated by three resignations. In Halifax, Revenue Minister Gail Shea this morning. People do expect accountability and, you know, that's something that our government has stood for is accountability and we think it's very important. In Ottawa, the opposition isn't quite seeing the resignations as resolving anything. The NDP this afternoon announced its writing to the commissioner of the RCMP asking police investigate the payment and the relationship between Nigel Wright and Senator Mike Duffy. Where's the paper trail? Who was involved? We have no idea. The NDP says it wants to know why the Prime Minister's former Chief of Staff would give Senator Duffy $90,000. The money paid off a high-profile outstanding debt Duffy had for wrongly claiming housing expenses. Mr. Duffy actually paid back. The government at first praised the paying back of the debt until the way it was repaid became public. Now the opposition wants police to look at whether any laws were broken and whether any promises were made for the money. If there is a signed agreement between Mr. Duffy and Mr. Wright or Mr. Duffy in the Prime Minister's office, we need to see that documentation. One thing that's got people scratching their heads is the wording in Wright's resignation. In the short statement released early Sunday morning, Wright says, quote, I did not advise the Prime Minister of the means by which Senator Duffy's expenses were repaid, either before or after the fact. Now, does that mean Harper wasn't aware at all or simply that he didn't know all the details? The NDP says the statement, by using the phrase, the means, is intentionally vague. The means, what does it mean? Does it mean that he wasn't aware whether they were 20, 50 or $100 bills that were being paid out? Now, the Prime Minister will address a caucus meeting tomorrow morning and could speak to reporters then. But otherwise, we won't hear from Harper on the resignation of his chief of staff until Wednesday at a scheduled press conference in Peru. Mike Armstrong, Global News, Montreal.